A box represents a market with only two goods, X and Y, and two consumers called Octavio and Abby. The box's dimensions, based on total quantities of X and Y available. Inside, every point is a possible division of these goods between Octavio and Abby. The top right, Octavio's. The bottom left, Abby's. The rest of the box, shared. Indifference curves are combinations where each consumer is equally content whether they have more of X or Y. They're convex. This mirrors life's diminishing returns. The more we have, the less we want more. Where these curves touch, we find equilibrium. It's a point where neither Octavio nor Abby can improve their lot without reducing the other's happiness. The Edgeworth box helps us understand market dynamics, trade-offs, and how we reach an equilibrium in resource distribution. Have insights? Drop them in the comments. Like the video, share, and subscribe for a history teacher's look at economics.